What it is, guys? It's your old boy Pilt coming at you with uh, our new semi weekly um, uh, uh, Super Strike videos. Um, today we are running the strength types, and since I already have Tau Pai Pai all the way up to uh, SA15, we're going to slowly work on trunks. Now, I'll show you why I say slowly, and it's something I've talked about in the old videos, but that was literally like two months ago. So we'll talk about it here at the end. Uh, so stick with me for a moment. But I'm very quickly going to go over our, our team, and we're going to go into an actual metal event, something I haven't done in a long time. So, let's take a look here real quick. Um, if you've been running the Super Strikes with me, you pretty much know how this goes, and this first character should be pretty familiar. We are running the Vegeta from the Super Strike events that occur early in the week. That is the Monday events. Uh, he is SA-12. I will have him SA-15 before the end of the day. I hope. hope I didn't jinx that either. We are also running... Ten Shinhan or Tian, um, he is SA. F is he SA fifteen? It should be, I believe. Yeah, Super Tech Max. He's SA fifteen. I need to get him up to a UR level. That'll happen with time. SA fifteen is the most important thing, though. All right. Now, everyone else from here on out, with the exception. No, I don't think the Trunks is. We'll, we'll talk about it. All right. I do have Yamcha, who's also free to play. Um, he is the UR. He came from the. Last year's April Fool's event on the JP side that we just received earlier this year. Long story. I am also running uh, Oceanus Shenron because she is, and she's a she, she comes from the DB summons. She is free to play, technically. Because um, the, the, that comes from the ticket summons that follow the world tournament. Um, I'm also running this Trunks. I think this is a summon only Trunks. I don't remember. Or is this the one... The other one's tech. I don't remember where he comes from. You can run any other unit here. The only re reason I'm running him is because he's cheap. He lets me run my other Super Strikes. I am finally running the Super Strike uh, Paiku Han because Paiku Han is actually Super Strike and free to play. I need to get him up to SA-15. I need to actually awaken him to the next level, but that'll happen on Monday. Um, I probably won't make a video about that. Maybe we'll see. It depends upon how I feel. I think we've done enough of that. I think moving on to the other events will be more more pertinent going forward. But we'll see. Maybe I'll do it. Maybe I'll do a bonus. We'll see. All right. And finally, um, as you always want to do, is you want to build a team with a cost of 52. Why? So you can run your uh, type godly. In this case, we're running Super Vegito. And if you don't know, he's a damn boss. So he's going to be our hero for this matter. Now... As for the items I'm running, the main thing is to bring Senza Beans. You shouldn't even need them, but that's going to be it. Um, I do have some other items down there, including the um, uh, the attack and health boost for my type. I might just try it just to see what we get, but we shouldn't need it, honestly. It should be three hits and we're done with uh, Super Vegito. So, let's jump into it real quickly here. And I have a tendency to ramble, so I'm going to try to jump through this real fast. Ooh, can I get a one? No, I cannot. All right. So I do want that gold. That would be nice. All righty then. Oh, man, a lot of medals. A lot of medals I need. Man. That is super nice. All right, nothing else I'm really worried about that I can at least get. Jumping in here. Now... You shouldn't need to run the key path with this team, and the reason being is because our both our leaders give us plus three key. That should be more than enough. All right. And remember, when we come up with a situation like this, our goal solely is to drop down the blue key for um, Vegito and to block the rest. So, we'll do that. Oh man, we're running slow again. Let's see if that boosts it. See, we got some blue key here. All right, not so worried about this. This is the one situation in which I'm like, we probably will have to heal for that, because our health kind of sucks. Did I give you a super off? I guess I did. All right. Now, if we can help it, I want to try to put Super Vegito in the front. Uh, I do want Yamcha to get hit, though. I'm going to put Yamcha at the end. 
Perfect. Perfect. And now it doesn't matter what we do, because Vegito's going to end this. Alright. And remember that you only need three, um, three key to defeat him. That's it. Now let's take a look here. Alright, that's perfect. Alright. He'll probably do about 20 damage, but he should only super once. Um... I'm gonna go ahead and be silly. That probably will help. Uh, let's see. Drop all that key down. We're gonna save that key for uh, Vegito next turn. And maybe. Let's see how much damage Ten Shinhan does. This would be a good damage test for him. Not bad. Could be better, could be worse. First Super Strike is not terrible. Yeah, here we go. Oh, this is almost like the perfect scenario, too, is the best part. And I'm going to go ahead and use him. I'm just, I haven't done this before. I just am curious. I don't usually use attack type um, buffs. I usually save those. But let's see here. So he'll attack us once. Hopefully he won't super. And then we'll, uh, we'll retaliate and then hit him back. Perfect. Only 66 damage. Boom. And that's why we love Super Vegito. Oh, don't text me. Alright, let's go. Perfect. Oh, he's getting a second attack. Oh, this person's got him duped. That is nice. That is perfect. And we're done. Wasn't expecting that, but that's a thing. Alright. That was the easiest to, easiest Super Strike Metal event I've ever run. Um, that was the perfect scenario, because even if he didn't do it, um, I don't think the it was worth running the um, the buff, but maybe. Um, especially with Super Vegito, because Super Vegito does do his retaliate. Uh, I don't need him as a friend right now. He does do the retaliate, so that in and of itself is pretty cool. Now, um, you may or may not want to try that. Depends upon if you have that uh, support item. It's a pretty common support item, so you should. Um, was it worth? I'd probably do it again with, with Super Vegito because it helps his counterattack. And when his counterattack happens, in that situation where we're getting attacked twice by Trunks, probably worth because you're hitting with 20% more damage three times or four times, as the case may be. So, really, really cool. I thoroughly enjoyed that and I wasn't expecting to. Now, let's talk about items real quick. Um, as you guys know, uh, I've had some questions about duping Super Strikes, and the reason I say it's not worth it is because, remember, you're going to have to get them up to the SSR level. To do that, it's going to cost you Bulmas and Turtles. Now, I've o o awakened a fair number, but maybe only half of the Super Strike characters. That's why we've been so picky about how we run these throughout the week. And you'll see, I only have 12 Turtles. I can't. I can't increase it, but you get the idea there. Only 12 turtles and 18 bulmas. Um, I've seen them come up in the Baba Shop a couple of times, but not terribly often. So you want to be very cautious about how you run that. That's why we're not so worried about awakening the um, agility type, or the, I'm sorry, the strength types yet. Because the only time the strength type is going to be worthwhile is when, I believe it's Frieza, yeah, I think it's Frieza that becomes an agility type at the uh, or it, when his fourth level opens up. Um, so, not worth it at the moment. But collect the medals, collect the characters, get them to an SA-10, and just store them off to the side for a little bit. It doesn't take up that much room, it's not that difficult, and when that happens, you will be prepared. So, definitely something to think about. Plus, the SA-10 character will then help you with the Super Strikes coming up. Um, that said, he will be good for, for Friday. Uh, I have been running the Friday events. I have all my Fridays up to SA-15. Um, those are all the physical types, I should say. So, Physical Friday will not be happening tomorrow. Instead, tomorrow we will be preparing for LR Goku. We're going to try to get our Gokus up to SA-10 
and get him ready to run in that event. So we'll cover that tomorrow. Uh, as for now, um, Super Strike events are going to be running Tuesday and Thursday. Um, maybe the bonus one next week, Monday. We'll have to see how it goes. But that's kind of the video for now, guys. Um, I hope this was helpful. Uh, per usual, like if this has been helping you and if you've been running alongside me. Um, do comment, uh, questions, all that stuff, ask below. Um, and uh, if you know someone that's playing the game, share this video out. I, I want to see this helping people. The more of those likes I get, the more of those, you know, hey, you're helping, the, the better it is and the better I can make my content. So, um, but as always, if you have anything further or if you want to know other events coming up and things like that, uh, I will be amending the Gleam campaign, which is down below. You can, uh, all it requires is a sub. I will be amending that to give you more chances to win. If you want more information on that, hit me up on Booker, and I will lay your ass out, in particular, because I don't like that face. Next time.